Hello and welcome to No Man's Sky, everybody. This is Elon Paul. We're going to be doing the Anomaly mission this morning. I usually do it on a Friday evening, but with family in town visiting, I thought I'd get a little bit of a late start, unfortunately, to this. But hey, this is uh, going to be a short video. We'll have some videos out probably later tonight and this evening. But here we are. We're going to go ahead and take my hunter today as the starship of choice to do our Anomaly mission from. As you can see, my freighter is currently upside down to the planet I'm currently uh, checking out. Really weird positioning, of course, but we'll get by. All right, and I hope you all have been having fun, been doing well in the last couple days. Got some neat upcoming videos in the in the old noggin here, I guess. I've got some ideas and some interesting videos to be doing, but we're definitely going to be continuing with the, um, that special permadeath run that we've been doing that Beeblebum created, and we're going to be going through that here over the weekend, as well as a couple others, so keep an eye open for those videos. Here we are in the anomaly. All right, let's get started and see what we got going on here. A little bit of a subdued voice. I'll be, I'll be completely honest with you folks, I just woke up, so I just wanted to get this knocked out before the rest of the house got moving along here. Anonymous assistance rescuing a stranded life form is the event of choice this weekend, giving us 1800 Quicksilver, of course, and 11 life support gels. I don't have enough of those, I think I'm down to 200. So let's make sure we get some of those. We're going to go ahead and initialize the mission. Uh, we're going to be, for the safety of its habits, Space Anomaly's entrance must remain secret. Interesting, I like all that. Uh, distress signal within range of the anomaly has been traced. Travelers are asked to visit its last known coordinates and anomalous, anomalously aid any survivors. Let's go ahead and do it. Mission started. We'll get the special music in a second. There it is. Okay. And off we go. There we go. Okay, good deal. So now we're on our merry little way. So this one's always a very interesting mission if you've never tried this one before. It's uh, kind of strange because you got to rescue this guy, but you got to look for a certain part to his ship that he's missing or that has been damaged. So. Okay. Where are we going? Looks like we're going right there. Ooh, aggressive sentinels. And it's activated indium, I'll say. So we're in a blue system. So if you guys don't have the ability to go to blue systems, uh, places to have indium, this is a good chance to set yourself up a little base. And you can get here in advance of having that particular hyperdrive on your... Uh, yeah, hyperdrive on your ship. Now, the aggressive sentinel portion is going to make this really interesting. You know what? They say to look over there... I've got a landing zone here I could probably land at. But let's check things out here real quick. Let's see. So it says it should be over there. Looks like I've got two ships flying past. I love how this thing can stand still. Just about. Okay, let's go a little further this way and take a look. And if you look at your radar, yep, yep, you see that little blip that just popped up? That is our guy that we're looking for. So he should be... Right in front of us someplace. Right over the, the hill, maybe? There he is. This is our spot. We could have landed at that landing zone, but I'll land right here. Please don't land in his ship. Good grief. Hey, when that happens. All right. I wasn't intending to do that. Ignore it, please. All right. So hopefully we can get through this without too much going on. So let's talk to our traveler here. He flinches. They stare at me oddly as though they can see right through me. Forlornly, Traveler Trud chose me their ship's melted navigation computer. This part is far beyond repair, but it could potentially be replaced. Okay, so we gotta search for that part. Now we could do things here. You can go ahead and search for items and pick things up. That's up to you. I am going to go straight into the mission now. 
Uh, I don't, uh, you know, don't underestimate checking out some of the planet's denizens. Because I don't know how many are on this planet, but... Let's see. Twelve of them. You know, you can get some nice nanites on this planet if you can find them all. Uh, there's also Gravitino Balls. That explains the sentinels that are really upset for you being here. Alright. But what we need to be doing... Hang on a second. Yeah, okay. Is we need to do Target Sweep. Looks like it's finding something right there. So let's go ahead and pick that up. And be prepared to start a fight. Hey, guess what? We're about to start a fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll get to you in a minute. And we're going to pick that up. Uh, let's see. Uh, as you know, I've got my new weapons here. Oh. I don't want any extra jobs. Thank you very much. Let's just get rid of you guys. And I think we've got about all of them, except for... There's someone over here. There he is. The original. Okay. Let's just go over here real quick so we can scan this thing. Uh, let's see, it's right here. Yeah, it looks like it's a good unit, so this is going to go ahead and find a spot where we can decrypt it. That's good, and we'll be heading that way in a minute. Now, a couple different things we can do here. We can run around for a little bit and try to escape these guys. And we need to head that way. Fifteen minutes away, so we should be able to get there by ship pretty quick. Okay, deactivated. The problem is, is that there's a whole bunch probably near my ship right now. And they're going to alert somebody almost immediately. See, there they are. They're up there. So let's go ahead and jump in the ship. Now, we could have fought them <clears throat> all five waves and then shut down the Sentinel network here, but no need to do so. And this ship should be pretty close by. Yeah, that's what I thought. And it's not a ship, pardon me. It's just a terminal. Now, if you're unlucky enough, you'll have to go after more and more buried technology in order to find the exact unit that they're looking for, so. And nowadays, they can even sense you in your ship. The little sentinels on the planet, the aggressive ones. See? There we go. And they'll always be protecting. Where'd he go? There we go. There's one more. There we go. Feel free to grab the supplies while you're here. Oh good, there's more. That's not what I was trying to do. Come on, really? Was I really, really trying to get navigation data right now? Let's, let's see, uh, pleasant, please present compatible device, decrypt, detected pairing, key downloaded syncing, device decrypting, look at this, this is hilarious, it's like they can't see me at the moment. <laughs> Thanks. Do I stand still? No. Yeah, you know what? Let's switch over. Hey, that's mean. Come on now. Uh, let's see. Let's go with uh, Jack. It's burying me. <laughs> really? I'm gonna have to work on that. I'm not going to collect any more supplies here. We're going to go ahead and continue on. I thought I had a, uh, still had one of my weapons that had a uh, pulse spitter on it. I'm going to have to work on that. Uh, they're searching. Alright. 
So now what we're going to do here is we're going to go ahead and scan over this. Uh, drive over here real quick. I thought they were searching for me, but I forgot I have to get to a point where they're not looking for me anymore. So it is what it is. Alright, where are you? Take this next grouping out. Almost made it. Hold on just a second here. See, this is a pain in the neck. Ugh. There you go. See that? And you land and you can get out of that fight after that. So that's a little trick you can try. Uh, where is my guy? Yeah. Oh, it's a hot storm, too. So I'll be able to go a little further here. And you can just pull in your ship afterwards if you want. Oof. Lightning, too. You gotta be careful of that. Because lightning can actually strike and hit you. You gotta be careful in these storms. <laughs> Made it. What's up, buddy? Alright, he flinches. They stare at me oddly as though they can see right through me again. Well, here's your part. Thank you. And he just leaves. That's the incredible part. He just literally... He's still kind of there. Why is he still kind of there? Okay, that's just creepy looking. Should I get a picture of him? That is really, really, really weird. Yeah, I kind of like that. Let's just get a picture real fast, huh? Hmm. Yep. Sentinel Force has been disabled, too. So we can call on our ship now. As long as you have the navigation data. Are you kidding me? I hate you. I hate you. And I'm kind of hating all of you. Just want to like be clear about this, okay? All of you. So what we want to do is I'm going to go all the way over here. Okay, they deployed down there, so now. Let's see if we can do this. See, this is all, it's, it's like a mix. Every time you have these stinking planets, the progressive sentinels, they, hey, trust me, they have their place. You know, especially if you want to gather up materials and, you know, glass and everything like that and get some extra nanites and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, that, that's worth it, but. Got it. All right. We're out of here. Yeah, no sending up panels today. We're just going to go ahead and get out of here. I think I'm far enough away, but I'm just going to play it safe. All right, there we go. Pulling our anomaly, and we're going to complete the mission. There we go. So that is, as they say, that. That didn't take more than 15 minutes. Isn't that neat? So we've learned a couple things. We've learned how to rescue the stranded person there. Uh, we've learned where to find the items that we need in order to rescue them. We learned how to avoid sentinels, how to fight them. And we also learned that I need to uh, find my pulse spitter because for some reason it's missing from my tool. Um, not a big deal, but and I've already checked out the tools that have everything on them. But for some reason it's missing my pulse spitter, which is one of my favorite weapons. So I'll work on that later. So we're back at the Nexus. We are going to complete the mission. Ding! And we get our 1800 Quicksilver. And thank heavens, because I was running low. Okay, great. Where are we with 
the collectibles over here at the Quicksilver vendor. Uh, create, and what do we got? 99% unlocked. I wonder if I could just stand here for a few moments and it will become unlocked. But that hood should unlock very, very shortly here. So that is fantastic. If you want to check it on your own, you can always go in here and go to the community research portion of your missions, and it will tell you where you're at. So literally, it should unlock sometime today, probably within the hour, the way things are going. So go ahead and do your anomaly mission, and it probably will unlock. So that's where we are. Um, I hope you liked and enjoyed this video. Please hit that little uh, you know, thumbs up thing down there that says that you liked the video. Really appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed, why haven't you at this point? Come on, hit the subscribe button. You've got hundreds of people you're subscribed to. You're not even sure you subscribe to them anymore. Subscribe. Don't worry, I'll be there for you. All right, folks. Thanks. Take care. Please uh, enjoy the next videos that I come out with. Like I said, I'm going to come out with a couple more over the weekend. And we will see you guys later. Take care, everybody. Thanks. Bye-bye.